A cardiac study in nuclear medicine is an examination performed to detect the presence of blockages in the coronary arteries that can cause a pain known as angina. Areas where the heart's blood supply is normal are detected and imaged thanks to an injection of a very small amount of radioactive product. By comparing the images of the heart obtained at rest and the images after a cardiac stress, the nuclear medicine specialists can evaluate if one or many walls of the heart suffer from a lack of blood and oxygen supply. The study is generally conducted on the course of two days, one where the heart is imaged after a cardiac stress and the other one where the images are taken at rest. Depending on the physical condition of the patient, two different options are available regarding the procedure to induce cardiac stress. It may either be imparted by physical exercise or induced using a special medication that stimulates the effect of physical exercise on the heart and blood circulation. The procedure for a cardiac stress from physical exercise is as follows. Electrodes are placed on the patient's chest to monitor his or her cardiac rhythm. The patient then runs or walks on a treadmill with a gradual and progressive increment in speed. Once the desired cardiac heart rate is reached, the patient receives a very faint amount of radioactive substance intravenously. The physical effort on the treadmill is maintained for an additional minute. The patient then rests and waits for approximately 45 to 60 minutes. Finally, the procedure is completed by an image scan of about 5 to 15 minutes. The procedure for a medical-induced cardiac stress is as follows. Electrodes are placed on the patient's chest to monitor his or her cardiac rhythm. A medication that stimulates the effect of physical exercise on the heart and blood circulation is injected into the patient intravenously. After approximately 7 minutes, the patient receives a very faint amount of radioactive substance intravenously. The physical exercise stimulation ends one or two minutes later following the injection of a last medication that cancels the effects of the first one. The patient then rests and waits for approximately 60 to 75 minutes. Finally, the procedure is completed by an image scan of about 5 to 15 minutes. No matter by which methods the cardiac stress was induced during the first part of the procedure, the second part occurs as follows. First, the patient receives a very faint amount of radioactive substance intravenously. The patient then waits approximately 60 minutes. Finally, the procedure is completed by an image scan of about 5 to 15 minutes. The obtained images are then analyzed by a nuclear medicine specialist who will establish a diagnosis. A pregnant or breastfeeding woman should notify the medical staff of her condition so that the procedure can be adjusted accordingly. The patient must plan for two separate days to complete this examination. For each day, the patient should be available for approximately three hours, including less than 15 minutes spent under the camera. It may occur for the examination to be performed entirely in a single day. In this case, the patient must allow for approximately six hours to complete the procedure. Possible side effects associated with a cardiac stress procedure by physical exercise or shortness of breath, tired legs, feeling of weakness, chest pain, a temporary increase in blood pressure, or irregular heartbeats. Possible side effects associated with a medically induced cardiac stress are headaches, abdominal and gastric contractions, a feeling of heaviness, a feeling of warmth, chest pain, nausea, and irregular heartbeats. Both types of cardiac stress procedures are supervised by a physician who ensures that everything runs smoothly. At the end of the cardiac stress, the patient is generally free of any significant side effects. The patient must fast for four hours before each part of the test. Under the recommendation of the referring physician, certain cardiac medications may have to be stopped before the test. For a medically induced cardiac stress, the patient must not take any caffeinated products for 24 hours before the examination, which includes coffee and decaffeinated coffee, tea, any products containing chocolate, soft drinks, and energy drinks. A good water-only hydration is recommended 12 hours before and after the procedure to facilitate the elimination of the radioactive product. For more information on nuclear medicine, its practice, and its benefits, please contact the Canadian Association of Nuclear Medicine. Visit our website and watch our other educational videos.